What's up guys, it's your boy Max and I'm back today giving y'all another video. I know it's been a while, don't hold me to it. Today we are going to be making some chicken wings. I'm making my Badia sweet and spicy wings. And the reason why I call them Badia wings because that's the brand name of the uh, seasons I use. If you ever saw Badia, I'm going to show y'all. Um, it's like four seasons I use, the tropical, the sazon, paprika, and adobo. Now, with these wings, um, you can change the intensity of your spice level because I use hot sauce, but I also like red pepper flakes. But today, I'm not going to put any like red pepper flakes or um, Cajun in it or like cayenne pepper because my little brother is going to be eating some and I don't really know how spicy hot he likes his stuff, but he sleep Anyway, so let's get to it and let's start off with showing y'all all of the ingredients. So first we got our Badia Paprika, we have the adobo seasoning, we have the Sazon Tropical seasoning, and we just have the regular Sazon, and then we have our mustard as a binder, and some hot sauce. You know, I like to keep it short and simple. These seasonings are, you know, in y'all local grocery stores, Food Lion, Walmart, Publix, Kroger's, wherever you shop at. Okay, first things first, we're gonna add our mustard. Like I said, this is a binder. Now, if y'all want your wings to be um, more spicy, get you some pepper flakes or use some um, like pepper flakes and like some uh, Cajun seasoning. But I'm just gonna do hot sauce. We're gonna add our sazon. And we're gonna mix all of this up because we want all this, you know, evenly coated. And like I said, I just got these ingredients. Now, you know, when you season the chicken, you can use basically whatever um, seasoning you want. Paprika, you know, it ain't got no flavor really just for the color. <laughs> but like I said, I had the size of tropical the regular sazon and uh, adobo. These are the seasons I like for chicken wings. I'll also be using um, Obey. Obey is another seasoning I like to do on my chicken wings. Sometimes I make like an Obey um, hot, like an Obey lemon pepper hopper or something like that. So you're gonna mix all this in, get down and dirty y'all, and mix, mix, mix your wings. Get the seasonings everywhere. We are going to flour these up and I'm going to fry these in some grease. You also can, if you don't want to flour yours, you know, like fry yours in grease, do you some in your um, air fryer. You know, that's a new wave. Everybody got an air fryer. I love mine. I have a Ninja grill that also air fries. And I love using it. I could have did these in, the, in there, but I'm gonna fry these up today. I'm gonna add some more Sazon Chocolate. We want these wings to be good and seasoned all over. You want the flavor everywhere. I'm gonna let these sit for about 30 minutes to an hour. Let that marinate and then we will be back to fry them up, guys. So guys, I just have some regular all-purpose flour from Publix. I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of this is another video season. It's the complete season in Sazon, complete. My grease is heating up. I'm cooking it today in my a little Presto fryer. And so we're just gonna put some seasoning on this flour while this is heating up. Y'all, it is so hot outside. Summertime hot. You know, last thing you wanna be doing it in the kitchen is cooking frying but i gotta give y'all a video 
So we just got our chicken wings in here. We're going to evenly, evenly coat them, guys. As you see, I think I'm going to fry about uh, seven at a time in my basket. So you just evenly coat your chicken wings. And remember, like I said before, y'all can use, you can use whatever uh, season that you like. Whatever your favorite season is to use on chicken, these are mine that I like. So that's why I'm using these for my but You can just keep go on the same idea. After we fry these up, we gotta make our little sweet honey sauce that we're gonna toss the wings in. All right, guys, I'm gonna drop these in. Fry those up. I like my chicken wings uh, real crispy, so I'll fry mine for like, extra crispy, I'll fry mine for like 13, 15 minutes. Cause we like extra crispy. All right, guys, so while the wings are frying up, we are gonna move on to our sweet and spicy sauce, which is only for ingredients. We have a stick of butter that I have been melting unsalted one stick of butter you have some light brown sugar hot sauce of course and honey so we are going to mix all of this together y'all want a sneak peek of the wings oh you see that oh. okay guys so like i said the sauce is a stick of butter unsalted i have a half a cup of hot sauce and I'm going to use a tablespoon of light brown sugar. Just a tablespoon. Just a <laughs> what he said. <laughs> and then we have our honey. So let's add our hot sauce. And then let's get a tablespoon of brown sugar roughly. First, Remember, taste as you cook. You can add more or less to what you want. My honey, we're gonna do like, let's start off with like a tablespoon. Stir that up. Stir your sauce and then taste it and add, you know, more or less if it's just right or do you need more. Guys, I just couldn't help it. I had to add me some Old Bay Spice in my sauce. I also added more hot sauce. Um, next time I would do a half a stick of butter because it was a little bit too buttery for me. So I would do a half a stick next time. And like I said, I added more hot sauce and I season it with some Old Bay to give it the extra kick, the extra spice. So now we are going to coat our wings. So I'm just gonna add a few dips of the sauce on the wings and then toss them up. All right, fam, I hope you enjoyed this recipe and going along with me. Our wings, let me know down in the comments if you make this recipe, hit me up. Or if y'all follow me on Instagram at Mexican by default, DM me, hit me up on there. Uh, I have another recipe for y'all. I have a dessert recipe coming, similar to the peach cobbler dump cake that I made for y'all that went viral. I have something coming up. But thank you for tuning in. Give this video a, a thumbs up, like, and comment. And I will catch you guys on the next go-round.